Hi, I'm Paul from pdhsports.com, leading online racket specialist. And this week, um, I'm very lucky to be in New York. Um, I'm here with Technifiber. We have a, a full week of play testing the new Carboflex squash rackets. Yesterday, we had Technifiber's uh, professionals here. I managed to get on court with them, and I'm also going to do some more testing today and give back my thoughts on how these new Carboflex play. We're going to start off looking at the Carboflex 125 air shaft racket. So there's two in the range. You've got the uh, Mohammed El Shabagi signature one. And then also we've got the Noor El Shabini. So both the same, the Noor El Shabini uh, brand new cosmetic uh, featuring the new sort of uh, Technofiber signature branding. Uh, it has a slightly smaller grip than the uh, Mohammed El Shabagi version couple of new features this year so it comes with the air shaft so whereas before it used to have like the arms coming out they've now sort of streamlined this further um, speaking to the the players I think they, they all have found it to be a slightly stiffer um, which has resulted in giving them a little bit more control that they wanted it also features a new string so the Dynamax is now called the Dynamax VP so it's a vapor process string, it's supposed to be more elastic, a little bit more um, power than is generated. I'm going to take these on court and uh, come back with some thoughts. Kicking this off with the 125 now. You know, it's so interesting sort of speaking to the top Egyptian players that used this racket yesterday. The one thing they both, well they all talked about was the new shaft just is maybe slightly stiffer. Um, the other thing that I found when I was hitting yesterday with, like, say, Mohammed El Shabagi was the fact that his style of play is so aggressive, you know, and that's why he chooses to use the 125 over the 130. <laughs> it's, a fast, it's a faster racket. So, as you can see, I'm quite far up the court here, and, you know, when you see some of the footage from me hitting yesterday, it was all about like speed and uh, aggressive hitting. And that's really what you get from the 125. For me, being such a big fan of the, the 125, I was actually felt quite scared about try, trying this because the last thing I wanted to do was feel like I, wasn't, I wouldn't like it. And I do like it, so that was a relief. I think this is where I feel the change is on the, on the length. It just feels you know, I, I hit shots and I, can, I just feel like I've got a bit more um, feel. When uh, I'm at the front of the court, you know, the, the balance is similar. If anything, it's slightly more head heavy than my X speed. But I said, after now two days of hitting with this, it just feels smoother on the length shots. And that has helped. I think that has helped. I'm hitting the ball a little bit tighter or it's something that's given me a bit more confidence to get the ball close to this wall. So let's say it's the racket. Uh, could also have been yesterday hitting with the top players. Uh, that really sort of forced me to up my game. But you know, like I said, this, with this being the one two five, this is not really, this is, you know, this racket wants to be moved around and it wants to be excelling a bit higher up the court you know this is more where you know you, you might find the 130 is is really good on the straight lines but I, I definitely think this is where the improvement has come in the racket I keep referencing my interviews with the sort of the top Technifiber players and they all feel that where the Copper Flex excels is you know, they all like to hit drop shots and tack the ball in and this is really is where the Carboflex does sort of excel in terms of um, for the teardrop classic head shape the control and that ability to take the ball in short is always there and uh, that's where I've sort of found that I've 
I like it. And uh, you know, you feel like you've got a lot of space across the head, and that's where the confidence comes. But every time you hit it, you know, it, it kind of gives you that feedback and that confidence to take the ball in short. As I've said in my review, and as like you'll see when you see the player interviews, this racket is all about sort of fast-paced, um, taking the ball in short, aggressive volleying, and um, you know with the new slight refinements. And like I say, that's really what it is. It's not like sort of they've not changed it because it, it, it was such a dangerous thing to change something that was so good. So uh, with this sort of X arms technology and the slightly more slim down. They've just refined it a little bit and you know it's quite interesting the string this the, the vapor process sort of dynamic string that they've now developed technofiber always have had sort of some of the best strings on the market so that is a big sort of add-on that you're going to get with this racket overall um really positive experience here in new york it was great to get the perspectives of the players yesterday and see what they thought and and you know in conclusion, it's just a slightly stiffer sort of shaft on the racket and small refinements. And then you have this sort of definitely iconic squash racket in the Carboflex. And it's going to be available at pdhsports.com.